What is up, YouTube? Welcome back to some more Assassin's Creed Valhalla. So, we're picking up right where we left off. We're going to go ahead and talk to Hytham, return those order medallions, and see what he has to say. I wonder if he's going to give us another quest to go to a certain area. That is kind of the hope. So, I want to continue with the storyline a little bit. If anything, we'll go ahead and choose another region today. So, let's go ahead and see. I cleared Winchester of the order, yet to do so meant working with King Alfred. Your poor fellow soldier led you to the King of Wessex? How very strange. He, or she, is toying with you, it seems. Keep this. It serves your cause better than it does my pocket. One more gone. The world is brighter for it. As a token of my deep gratitude, I want you to have this. Thank you. I expect there are yet more to claim. I have to go. Then go in peace. Hmm. Okay. So use the Order of the Ancients menu to find your targets. So does that mean... Okay, we didn't get our quest then. Which means we can probably just go ahead and set up another region. We'll go and check the Alliance map. Let's do it. All right, based on the map here and just checking our quest in general, we didn't get anything revolving around the Order of Ancients. They're kind of continuing the storyline. We do still have two possible regions that we can go ahead and take care of. I'm thinking of doing just Glowchester, just for the fact that it's a few under the Snidingham. And I kind of want to go still a little bit in order. So let's go ahead and start this. If anything pops up after, we'll go ahead and do that storyline but i think we're gonna have to take out these two regions and then kind of move on after that see what kind of else pops up hamptonshire still has not uh been available to us yet so i'm guessing it's going to be one of the last regions that we're gonna have to go to for the order but let's go ahead and start glowchester what transpires in gloucestershire you Glow. may have noticed that gunnar right. has disappeared from his forge he has traveled to gloucestershire in search of a wife, a wife? he's here he is in love. When did uh, this happen? When doesn't this happen with our dear, lovelorn blacksmith? But there is a bright side. He has asked you to join him. Join his search for a wife? And see that he does not make a fool of himself. I believe he thinks that your presence would bolster his image. Of course I'll go for him. There's our blacksmith. We found him. Well, not yet, but we will. <laughs> All right. I'll be Gunner's keeper. If only to bring him back in one piece. Very generous of you. Make for the town of Gloucester. You will find him there. All right. Hopefully we can actually befriend this region, unlike Winchester. I, I'm pretty sure we, we won't have a problem, but let's go ahead and see. There you are, Gunnar. Ah. And with a smile like I haven't seen in some time. What's up, man? Eivor. Long time no I see. you under wind. Gunnar. With the speed you left home, I thought you've been carried off by Valkyries. I have. This Valkyrie right here, Bridget, my own heart's root. Meet Aver. It takes a rare woman to nail down our Gunnar. Lavendine da, with my Zigwili. Uh, good to meet you as well. Can she not speak English, or...? How did you meet? Tell me about yourself. When are you marrying? How did you meet? How did you find a woman in these backwoods? She came through the settlement selling runes, outshone every stone in her satchel. She offered me a trade, a rune for a brooch I was making. I got a better deal. But she loves the ugly little thing. Have you uh, a family, Bridget? That mama dad carries even gilly than Anun. Couldn't have Druzmi. Bridget man power the last high priestess and elderman. They since passed on. But the current elderman looks out for her. I should like to meet this elderman of yours, if our kinfolk are to be joined. A union forged in love. Come, we go find him. Oh, and don't blame me if he's heard a tale or two about you. What about it, Bridge? Tim Jolch. You two bags of air see how come past the gallery. That they were all clear sound. I heard a war in there. No daylight to waste, then, huh? 
I don't like that so I can't the understand man may have heard a tale or two about my exploits. Not all from me. Your name will be on the lips of every skull for years to come. Hmm. And the Mercians here are not unsettled by lurking Vikinger? Right they come from all over to celebrate Samhain. Most are too busy with the festivities to pay us mind. Samhain? Is that what these carved roots are for? This tradition? Aye. Faces cut into lanterns to ward off evil spirits and guide children home. They have a haunted look about them. Let us bring a few back. <gasps> Alright, how far is this guy? Here we are. Hmm. I, I don't I still don't like the fact that I can't understand her. And I heard Avor in there. I heard the name. We'll find out there later. There's the elder man. Kunan. A good leader, seeing to his people's needs. Let us join hands when his task is done. Yeah. Then let's introduce you to Tevdur. Hands as clammy as a dead haddock, but his heart is in the right place. And he'll be elderman after Kunan. Tevdur, this is Eivor, my chieftain. Ah, uh, yes. The way Gunnar speaks, I expected, uh... Me to ride in on a winged horse, cure the sick, the blind. His compliments are as blunt as his hammer. Ah, more pagans crowding our table. Just lovely. Well, what brings you here? Yeah, really, what the hell is your problem? I am here to hasten my friend's marriage and drink my weight in ale. If friendship comes afterwards, then all the better. And what has Dane friendship done for Christian Mercia? Unseated god right kings for puppet rulers? Huh, I, I don't want to say nothing, but watch your tongue or re... You know what, let's act a little, little kingly. So-called puppet kings keep your lands safe and your bellies full. I ask no thanks. Only hospitality. A apples! Eivor, wait until you try the cider. You you like cider, eh? Tevder? Cider? Uh, yeah, these guys are ah, weird. You must be Eivor. Tevder, I see you've welcomed our honored guest. Come just in time for my last Samhain. At your behest. We welcome all pagans set upon God's own Gloucester. Tevder, as your harvest king, I demand that you remove the turnip from your arse and be merry. So you've come to meet the family before you whisk my Bridget away to her life as a smithy's bride. We're honored to have her join the Raven Clan, but your lush landscape will be hard to match. I must give away girl and land in this misty season, but Gunnar is a good man, and he speaks tirelessly of you. If you will excuse me, I have matters to attend to. Ah, yes, the shrine. And with so many thieves and fangs on the path, a fellow may fall in God's service. Kunon. I do not need a heathen escort. Youth cut down in its prime, without even the memory of warm thighs and cider to sustain him in the afterlife. Then, by my honor, I shall not rest until I return him to you safely. Aye, Tefter? I see I am outmatched. Though a Dane joining in praise to Saint Kenhelm, God will weep. My lady love calls, Eivor. Oh, if you'd like to join us later, we're going hoodening this eve. Go, may you have a fire-forged friendship. Watch for fairies, fenfolk, and fiends. I have a hand fastening to oversee, an apprenticeship to officiate, and a pig to slaughter. <clears throat> well, shall we then? We get it. You don't like us. But... We'll go ahead and see uh, which Alderman we're going to uh, befriend anyways, so... Samhain. <laughs> Kunon humors these pagans too much. It is the first thing gone when I am Alderman. Fires and magic. Spirits in the air. Gloucestershire has strayed from God's light. 
People need carousing, especially before the winter frost. A festival brings warmth and cheer. God's light does not dim as the nights chill, but the winters are hard upon the children. Seeing them run around, it lightens the heart. Are there priests in your lands? I've met a few, liked even fewer. The profane has gone unchallenged here. I alone am the reformation. They are a flock in need of my shepherding. And how will you lead this great renewal? They will fill the church's pews and we will thank him for all the gifts he brings. Not false idols of wood and clay. And yet, are we not going to pray at the idol of another? Is this Saint Canom your god? No, and we do not call him such. He is simply closer to the Lord's ear. Lo, in a mead of kine under a thorn, lieth poor Kenhelm, kingborn. Is this land not beautiful, Eivor? Aye. Look, the path is untouched by danger, so your company is not needed. You are a kinder man than the mask you wear. But you won't be rid of me. I will keep my word to Kunin for your safe return. We gotta speak to him. Gotta be in the right spot. I don't understand this Christian praying. I thank Odin while standing. Why get your knees dirty? To humble ourselves before God. Besides, I've dirtied my knees doing worse. That sounds like a tale I'd like to lend my ear to. Please, Eivor, I must pray. Should I watch or turn my back? Oh Lord, gift upon this lowly servant your greatest gift. Patience. I will not have to interrupt your prayer to protect you, Tefter. And yet you insist on doing so. What is it you are looking at? A hair? Tefter, get to safety. Oh, people are trying to attack them. Where did they come from? They're boars. They're wild boars. I think he's okay. I thought it was going to be like actual attackers. Ooh, ho, ho, ho. Sneaky little devil. Get out of here. Is there another one? That was close. No, there's not. We're good. Yo, you can't take out a couple boars? Luckily, hey, I was here, huh? Thank you. For saving my life. It's good I was here to protect you. Maybe Kunan has the eyes of prophecy. Splude. Cloven hoofed and sent by Lucifer himself. This land must be returned to God's grace. More likely the shrines in their territory. Lord, we thank thee for your protection. It's not safe here. Give me my moment's prayer, Eivor. I ask only this. We should return to Gloucester. Unless you'd like to thank the little martyr here for tonight's feast. I'm not a babe in the woods in need of constant guard. Go on without me. I gave Kunan- Yes, yes, your word. And when I see him, I will say you protected me from being skewered upon those devil's tusks. Oh, and Eivor, I owe you a drink at least. Later, if you'd have one, find me at the festivities. I mean, you're getting kind of pissy at us because we're trying to protect you, but now you're kicking us away. What the hell, man? All right, we gotta go speak to Gunnar. Let's go ahead and do that. Screw this guy. He can go and protect himself. Well, I hope I'm not interrupting anything. Eivor, there you are. I'm back. Here I am. So, what adventures did you find in my absence? Escorted Tefter to the shrine of some Christian saint. Our path was not peaceful. We were accosted by a group of boars. Odd, but path and I usually serve. To the Brevo. I can kind but of understand you saved some his of it. Hide. I bet it was quite the sight, two of you as a pair. I kept my word to Kunin, and that spat cock Tefter lives. Restraint, Eivor? I was half expecting you to wallop the lad around the head and ass. I've bridged hands with most of England, Gunnar, and I've held my temper around worse than Tefter. I need a drink. Try the cider. It's from last year's apple harvest. Skull. Skull. So, you invited me to a hoodening. 
What mischief is this? The Griskalan fell spread down in creatures of the veil. The bag for treats. Glower's just gives her glut to otherworldly visitors, and if you dress as one, you'll get that bounty yourself. Freely given? Huh. I've only seen such a thing done at feasts. Then we turn you into a beastie and have you roam the hills, braying for sweets and drink. It's hardly a disguise. Just a cloak and some bones. Nonsense. You are the very spirit of the Mary Lubed. Now, that's hidden. Become the Why am I wearing, wearing this, but you're not? sings for cake and ale. And you cannot have your cloak back until we leave. I'll keep this covering, but even a knife to my throat could not make me sing on command. Shame. I heard your voice clear as a bell. Locks fall from the sky in envy. Gunner, if no one else is dressed this way, I will fill your shop with sheep. Yeah, no one probably is. We, we look weird. All right, we have to knock on doors? So this is literally just knocking. Trick or treat. What business have you? Oh, the Mary Louid. Right, right. We're doing cakes instead of beer this year. Sour night and the moon is high. Mary Louid haunts my door. Hmm, give me sweets and the candid trees, the kind I must adore. The air is chilling and ghosts are spilling all across the misty moor. Ah, a little bit of haunt here, a little bit. Ah, let's give go for me the sweets door. and candied treats, the kind I most adore. <laughs> here then, sweets for the Mari Luid. You've earned it. Is this just a bunch of flighting? Are you playing the role of trickster spirits? Can trickster spirits see? The eye holes in this mask are terrible. All it takes is a mask and some sweet cakes. They really are. You into a gentle skull. That I'm not going not to adorable. sing, Gunnar. Yeah, we ain't singing. That's for sure. Are you ready to rhyme with me? Down the road from my abode, there is an open veil. Hope to God's is Mary Lou doesn't fail. I've been here knock wait, I've been here knocking and a walking, now give me a cake. Yeah. I've been here knocking and a walking. Now give me cake and ale. Brilliant, that is. We're so good. We got moldy cheese. Uh, lads getting into their cups. Just fantastic. Scaring the wee ones. Alright. Looks like this is the last one. Let's get this trick or treating done with. Good. Oh, thank the gods. We've been waiting for children all night to empty our store so we can go to the party. Have some extra. <laughs> Look at these cakes. Sweet as honey, Gunnar. You should see this. Gunnar. My cakes. What the? Find his whereabouts. What the hell happened? Ah. There you are. What the hell? Why am I? Why am I wearing this mask? Damn deserter! You are either fearless or stupid, boy, to speak to someone of the Raven Clan this way. Fitting name for scavengers, winged rats, taking what isn't yours. I'll pick out your eyes and feed them to your god. Gunnar, we are guests here. Let him go. We can hooden more. Oh jeez. You seem to want your nose broken. So let me oblige. All right. Christ and tall. That's enough. Okay, buddy. Better watch yourself. Wait, is it you 2v1? Should be burning alive. Oh. I thought I dodged it. Ho oh. ho. Are you sure you don't want to stay in Glowchester? Right. They know how to have fun. What the I dodged it. Okay, I guess I didn't. Oh. Let's go, buddy. You finished. 
There we go. Let's get some good hits on him. Four Boom. My leg. Got him. Guna. Beautifulest. Enough. Keep your brawls to the other side of the river. There's children about. I don't answer to you, witch. Thomas Fletcher. I brought you into this world, wiped your mother's birth blood from your face. Mind your tongue. Damn. Let's see that leg then. It's nothing. Careful with the old man. He's had many winters worth of wounds. To Lucas. Modron's a compass to patch this land. Will he walk again? The gash is deep. If I cannot save the leg, the pigs will eat well tonight. That man called you a witch. I lead those who follow the old ways in Gloucestershire, but I offer my healing services on both sides of the river. Gwenith, my love, go back to the house and bring me the garlic salt. And the worms? Are we cleaning or cutting, mother? Yes, grab the worms just to be safe. Now go, child. I promise not to cut it off before your return. I give me strength. Modern is known a humor I'm glad you all finding my mortal injury so funny. Go, Aver. Make Mary and try to loosen Tempter's shoulders. Modern, you don't have to save his leg. I will understand. That limb will be fine, <laughs> but no medicine in England will stop the dribble from his mouth. I do not work miracles. Okay. <laughs> so now we gotta go back to him? Okay, Tudor. Tudor. You know, I know the pronunciation of that name is not how it seems. But I'm gonna go to him anyways. With bitter ale and sweet friends, that is a fine way to end the day. Yup, that's exactly how I would put it. Eivor, there you are. Tefter. Tefter. You're well met. Guilim here has challenged my honor in a contest of drinks. Join us. The lab will be easy pickings. Huh? All right. Give sure. Give me a cup. Some ale, then. One for me as well. For shaveling of the Christ Lord, you have a lot of scars, Guilim. Not every tonsured man is a wet-eared abbey, babe. I came to God after I had scarred my soul with sin. To holy hearths and humid eyes, it is the best drunkenness returns a man to royal reason. Skull. Can we take off our our dumb mask now? We are the only one wearing it. Okay, I guess we gotta beat him with it on. Doesn't make any sense, but we gotta do it. Let's go, buddy. Oh my gosh, is that seven or six? That's six. Too strong for you. Come on, buddy. You gotta, you gotta catch up. Make it interesting. Alright, guys. This should be over pretty quickly. Well, that was pretty easy. He still had a full horn left. Come on, man. We even beat you with the mask on. This merriment feeds my soul. Here. Another drink on me for allies new and old. Of all the Eldermen I've met, you're the most unburdened. What is your secret? None. It is well known. The burdens I carry will soon leave this world with me. So drink to my life and death. Death? I am to be sacrificed in the Wicker Man as King of the Harvest. Like Elderman Simkin before me and all before him. Horrible barbaric practice. A burnt offering after poor crops. They hope well fed gods will smile upon them. A true father sacrifices himself for his people, gives his all, his blood and flesh. A great honor, but a sad fate. Hmm. When you speak these words, it reminds me of the Christ. I lad. Now you can see how a man like myself sees the value in both. A toast, then. To Elderman Coonan, joyous and generous. 
Let each man show him loyalty until he suffers death. My friends, you are kind to me. I'd like to toast my successor, Tevder. May he wear the horns head high. It's an interesting little tradition they got there. this water i feel like thaw chugging oceans no effect to my head or step <laughs> you had the man give him something stronger <laughs> this will work faster than any tonic good give me visions of all creatures that roam these hills and the sore head tomorrow to pay for it wow that tastes awful it feels good, though. Eivor, speak true. My feelings be damned. I have been an ass. Do not deny it. And I, for that, I am sorry. A colossal horse's ass. Yes. Soft words from a heartless heathen. Only fiercer than fire among ill friends. I can be very as nice as a spring gale. <laughs> and how nice is that? Oh, very, very nice. You're not suited for this. We're, we got to be friends because if he's going to be the new Alderman, we, I don't want to have any weird beef with him. Tefter, with Gunnar and Bridget's marriage, our clans will unite. But we could join by oath as well. Oh, yes. My first ally as Elderman. We're I done. <laughs> we shall make an oath. How do we start? Yeah, the greatest, greatest oath and the greatest union. To the oath. The treaty. The greatest. Guy is drunk off his ass right now. More ale to seal our friendship. <laughs> this way, this way. Look out for the black sow. Sow? Like pig? Flaming pig. Chases you home at night. Oh, jeez. Silly words to scare silly children. I feel like it's you gonna be real. You seem magic as the stuff of children's dreams. Perhaps. I judge too much. Truths I half believe. Foolishness sometimes takes my tongue. I have to piss. <laughs> ah, a great blackness chases stars across the sky in great whirls of color and light. Whoosh! whoosh. Here we are. <laughs> right inside here. Eivor, you can't even walk straight, man. You still have the mask on? Tevder! He took it off. Tevder! <laughs> Tevder! Where are you? <laughs> we gotta go find him, don't we? Oh. There he is. What the hell is going on? This is like a long intro. There's got to be something that happens. <laughs> yep, there we go. We slept with the mask on. Hell's breath. What happened last night? Is that blood? Uh, and the effects of that draft still cling. 
Lefter, are you here? Wait, we're still drunk? Oh. We found a body. bodyguard. Killed by knife. Oh, jeez. Well, this ain't good. Mm-hmm. Clues and riddles. This has been broken, and it's covered in blood. A weapon, maybe. Oh, jeez. How did we get mixed up in this? We, uh, we got way too drunk. Could be Tefters, if he was the heavy thing being dragged. Hmm. Let's go ahead and move this. Can we, can we even move it? This is so hard to walk. Muddy footprints. Someone was hiding back here. What's happened here? Open this door! Come out of there! Is this the last one? Nope, I knew there was something else. I can't even see it, it's too blurry. Do we do we break that? There we go. Pouch. I wonder if it still has a little something stronger. But why is it here? Better hold on to it. So what does this lead to? The murderers hid here, lying in wait while we approached outside. They jumped from the shadows to kill the bodyguards. And to disable Tefta. Then they dragged him away. That accounts for everything. Except Quillen's pouch of herbs. I'm still unbalanced by Quillen's special something. Maybe Mother Modron will know the contents. Oh jeez. There he is! What is the meaning of this? Blood soaking our soil, oh, and crap. your weapon coated in the same. Kunan, please. More has happened here than you can see. Give me a right to parley my innocence. I should have heeded Tevder's misgivings about heathen party guests, and now he has paid with his life. With Tevder gone, Glowachester will be without an elderman. Eye for an eye, your Raven clan will lose their chieftain. Oh, jeez. We didn't do it. We were way too drunk. Get out of here. We gotta find and speak to that witch. Come on. Uh, you screw this. You're taking too long. There we go. Okay, let's go ahead and find that witch. Ah, there you are. We need your help. There's mud. We didn't do it. Mother, it's the friend of the mangled leg man. Eivor, you remember? Indeed. It's a surprise to see you. Is everything quite all right? I feel like we gotta be straight up about it. No, it's not. I awoke in Tefter's wrecked home. Blood, but no body. Kunin's men are after me for the lad's murder. Uh-oh. Did you stab him? Mother, can I see? Ah, uh, you're creepy. Blood, but no body? We must see what has happened to him. Do you recognize the contents of this pouch? A very unusual blend. There is a druid who uses this mix to aid sleep. A monk called Gwillem poured some of it into my drink last night. The effects were intense. Search the houses! Cut a gun fire! Oh, jeez. Don't, They're don't try and fight you. us. If they know I've aided you, it'll be my head next. Can you? I've seen nothing and no one. Mother, if the stranger wants more of the herbs, they can talk to the druid Halewyn. Yes. Halewyn's cabin is on a lake near where the Cherwell and Great Oust rivers meet, but he is a strange fish. Rarely does he speak to mortals, preferring the company of spirits. Now, I have business at Rollandrich. Find me there later. Okay. Uh, I guess we gotta find the druid. So we got a little bit of a uh, little bit of magic and witches with Gloucester. This is gonna be fun. That must be the home of the druid. It seems like it. it's kind of labeled Druid's Cottage, Eivor. Come on. I thought it was just a spot on our map. It was pretty easy to find, so. Alright, let's go talk to this one. This is Druid. Oh, spirit! You have finally come! Days ago, 
A passing cloud foretold your arrival with droplets of sun-scented rain. But what form of being are you beneath this guise of horse and bone? From the realm of the Fey? I know you cannot say. I, I press no more. Whatever you be, now you are here, the ritual may begin. Oh, but the men of straw must announce you with sparks. Ignite the sky to begin anew. Here at the death of the season. Until then, I await you, giving thanks in the glen. What? We have to help you prepare for the ritual? Oh, jeez. What is it? Hailwind said that the Wickerman must announce me with fire. Perhaps oh. I should set them ablaze. Well, a Wickerman speaks. Now let them speak in chorus. Yes, another joins the throng. Another. How many are there? Let there be cacophony. One more. One more. There we go. They roar. Do you hear them? A chorus of fire. That should be the last one. Back to the druid. Speak to me, O oh wind. This guy's crazy. I have come to ask you a single question. Something about your demeanor and your physical manifestation now gives me pause. Are you truly a spirit of light? I am a spirit as any other. Then prove it. You must know the depths of the world's mysteries before I will help you. Tell me the proper use of charms. Very well. Ask your riddles. Oh, crap. Okay. Which charm protects from evil spirits? <laughs> it literally gives us, I'll be back, or repeat the question. Okay, I, I guess I'll be back. Give me a measure of time. Are you a spirit of darkness? If it be not so, come back and try anew. What are these things he's asking me? There must be trinkets around his house that will help. So that's what we were looking at. So when we did our Odin site, we saw those two right there. Okay. This dagger is placed upside down. Upturned blade, release the past. Round about be the circle cast. Within the circle, at morning dew, death be death to the old, begin anew. Okay. I hope we don't have to remember these, but we're gonna do our a knife, and the vile smells of poison. Three ways to kill someone. Oh. Lords and the lowly die a threefold death. A hangman's noose stifles the breath. A knife turns quick to mud. Drink from the well, you'll cough up blood. Threefold death. Okay, okay. I'm trying to remember these. I don't think we'll get a second chance here. But, okay, we gotta go down here. Let's go, Avort. Alright, love letter. Another year of early blossoms. Have you sent them from your side? Always the soothsayer in life. I can see you keeping the gods as a captive audience on the other side. Boots has had another light litter. We'll be as rich in cats as we were in love. Sleep well, my beast. That's the same thing. What's this then? There we go. Two ladles carved from a single branch. The grooves match. The rise of moon, the set of sun, one is two and two is one. Day breaks, they mend the cloth, evening falls, they share the broth. Okay. Clues can be found in the cottage. We still have one more. There's one more. I believe it's like just outside the cottage. Let's get to it. Oh, this is this symbol it? is one I've seen carved into shields and headstones. Okay, gather the strands magic bestow to ward off the spirits of evil and woe. Tied so tight the circle is sealed and closes within the strength of the shield. Okay, so this is the one. Gather the strands of magic bestow. The circle is sealed and closes within the strength of the shield. Okay. There we go. That was the one I think we needed. But I think the other ones will he'll probably give us a few minutes. Have you found yourself? 
If you are a spirit of light, answer me this. Shield. Oh, crap. Which charm protects from evil spirits? The symbol of the, the Celtic nut wards off harm. A secure nut indeed. Only one of light need not fear it. Tell me, O oh being of air and light, which is the charm you would use to leave the past behind? It's only given us one, so. The Atome Dagger cuts our ties with the past. The upturned blade. Things can be reversed. You know this charm. Which charm is it that gives speech to the dead? Wait. Give me a measure of time. I thought we thought of Are you a spirit of darkness? If it be not so, come back and try anew. I thought we found them all. Which ones are we missing? Is there like a few around? Oh, you are open, like they've been screaming secrets. Tell me, my friend of the unbreakable bond. Tell me, O oh friend of the journey beyond. Speak to me, for speak you must. Speak to me through your tongue, be dust. Okay. Let's do a double double check here. Make sure there's. Nothing else. I don't think there's anything else, so we should be good. Speak to me, O oh wind. I am speaking. I'm trying. Turn around. Have you found yourself? If you are a spirit of light, answer me this. Which charm is it that gives speech to the dead? The Skull Souls charm summons voices from death's realm. In such fashion, I speak to druids long dead. But of course, you, a spirit, would know that. <laughs> you are a spirit of light. Mabon be praised. Would you like some bread and cream? No, just the answer to your question. This herb pouch made its way to Gloucester in the hands of a strange man. Do you know it? Aye. A mix to help him sleep. I filled this very pouch. And over a dandelion wine, he spoke fondly of his home, Kuth Lodron. Kud Lodron? <clears throat> Very well. I thank you, Halwyn. But this spirit has others to visit this harvest moon. Go with the wind and leaves, good friend of the hills. Okay. So, Kuth he gave us. Strange name. Meanwhile, Modron awaits me at the stones nearby. Okay, so we gotta go back to the witch. But why can't we? What is Kud Lodger in a place? Maybe. Wow, did I just kind of have like a blonde moment there? <laughs> I might have, but let's go ahead and find and speak to Modern. I can see Modern ahead. Oh, perfect. There we go. And this looks like another. Mystery that we have to solve. These are usually pretty easy. How far has the search we'll been stretched? Far enough to say it's best you stick to the countryside and wear that disguise. But Tefter's body has not been found as yet. That night was full of drink and merriment. I do not remember much, but I had no quarrel with Tefter. A sorry tale. Did you learn anything from Halewin? He gave some herbs to a man from Kuth Lodron, name of Gwilim. He was drinking with Tefter and myself. Kuth Ludron is the Welsh name for the thieves Warren. It's atop a hill west of here. I can lead you. I owe you a great deal for all your aid. You do not have to trust me. Tevder's fate is to my interest as well. This is a troubling development that I hope to get to the bottom of. Fair enough. Let's do it. Let's make haste then. I must find Gwilim and regain my honor. Oh, the Odin said, uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and do this uh, later. That's no problem. What? This forest and all of Glowichestershire feels untamed. I feel as if I've ridden my horse through a door to another world. Aye, there is old magic here. Old magic that would be snuffed out by Tevder and his church. Tevder did speak of reformation. Do you think that's why he was targeted? There are many who would claw their way to the top. Tevda's disappearance could be the work of any. But you are a witch. 
open to wisdom from the gods. Have you seen anything? I see much smoke. Are there any rival Danes passing through who could have done it? If it were rival Danes, we would have heard their horns by now. We are not a humble sort. Blunt tongues and sharp axes. I mean... Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Kuthladrin, a thieves' warren. This is where I leave you. You'll find somewhere safe. There's a shrine nearby. If you've need of me, then meet me there. Gods old and new go with you. Okay, so I'm guessing it's right up top of that hill there. Let's go ahead and do this. I'm pretty sure we're probably going to have to fight some people. I'm down. I think the best place to start off is with the archers. Well, archer. I'm just going to do the one for now. Let's go ahead. There's one guy over there. We can just go ahead. Arrow is facing. Okay. And there's some arrows to replenish down there. Let's go ahead and take out that guy. Actually, let's go ahead and keep moving forward. Good thing the arrows are one shot. Because then they all make noise. I don't really want to just full out bum rush these guys. Even though I could. Kind of want to do a little stealth action. So, we're going to go ahead, jump off here. Yeah. I think... Oh, yeah, we can. Oh, no. we, ooh, we can get all three. Nice. I was expecting to throw an axe at this guy, but looks like we're just throwing at this one. Why do we still have a mask on? I, I, I'm still going to question that. Like, what, what is the point? What are we doing? Let's go ahead and grab the it doesn't seem like too many people. Ooh, this one's gonna be a little bit tough. Let's go around here. They shouldn't Arms see us. Actually. Okay. Hey! I found you. So he lives. Ooh hoo hoo, where are you? Oh, you're over there. No. Gotcha. That was close. That was close. Can we get in here without... You know what we do. Distraction. Distraction. I don't know if that worked. What do we have? Better keep all easy, pug. I say we just go ahead and bum rush this guy. Let's go ahead and assassinate these two really quick. Yep, they're definitely gonna see us, but we can take out this one. Okay, maybe not this guy. Look at him now. Wait, that didn't kill him, did it? Eh, I'll be able to lie. It's okay. There we go. Alright. Who is next? I just destroyed your Goliath guy oh, and yelled in his face even though he's dead what the you guys have two Goliaths go bro wait what I mean I'm taking out two people because of it but like I kind of wanted to use it on the Goliath okay I'm getting my adrenaline back anyways you hold on. I'm gonna go for this guy first. He's gonna die real quick. Ow! Okay. That was me. Alright. Get out of here. You get back here. Got him. Okay. Is that the last of them, or do we have someone? Oh, we have you. And we have you. Damn it. I missed. Wait, I thought I was going to throw it back. Okay. Ow, that's fire. You're burning, aren't you? Haha, <laughs> sucker. Hey, man. Ooh, I know you. I know what you look like. I know exactly what the man-at-arms people look like. 
and you suck as one of them. There's still another person. Now nah, we're good. Let's go ahead and take care of this. Don't. What? Need to get on the other side. God damn it! Let me go and get this really quick. I think I found the way in. Yeah, we kind of burned it because we thought that was gonna that was gonna work. Oh! And we found a new order member. Wait. Where's the, where is he? Okay, I was definitely in the wrong house. <laughs> that was my bad. It's all right. Oh shit! Is right, Avel. You're alive. Yeah. Have mercy. I were under orders. Elderman Kurnan, he gave us coin to dispose of Tepter. Then he should demand it back. Shit sale haunt you are. Cannot kill a single man. You made a poor choice in scapegoat, Gwilym. And we thought that if we kept the lad alive, we could squeeze Kurnan for more coin to keep it secret. I don't know if you're... You are so dumb, man. Like, why kill him? A dead man can't pay. It's true. You're lot You know what? Let's just go straight out at him. Looks like a man who lies to save his own skin. I look like a man up to his neck in sheep shit. Please, I'm telling the truth. Tell it to your guard. Look, we want to go to kill the lad. We've come to lie, cabin him around. Tell him. Tell him we've taken care of you. Kunan did this. Why? I've done nothing. To Oh, gods, is he dead? Wake up, wake up. Tell the Dean I've hand fed you like a baby sparrow. Ah, move, fool. Ah. Look, Eivor, we're mates, right? Uh, we drinks were. Together. Remember the chickens? Speak again and I'll take your tongue. Castor will need to see a healer. The slaughter been smearing dung on his face. But I've been held for ransom by worse men. Thank you for your aid, then. Try not to get held for ransom a third time after you flee. Thank you, stranger. Thank you. It is All much right. appreciated. We gotta carry you back to. Okay. In this that's a far. Oh, that's not that far. West. Save your strength, Tefta. Okay. It's a long ride. Cool on. Okay. <laughs> ordered my death. I don't understand. We can't even get around the pole. He's Wait. been like a father to me. I will ask him myself. One sec. I was mulish when he spoke of the pagans being. We went between the legs? Get the hell out of here. Don't be a douchebag. We killed all the rest of your peeps. I was mulish when he spoke of the pagans being just as we. Living in kindness under the laws of many gods. Okay. Time to die. No, it's not. It, well, it is for you. There's a difference. Get out of my way. I was betrayed. I'm not in a good mood right now. I was mulish when he spoke of the pagans being just as we. Living in kindness under the laws of many gods. One face, many faces. It matters not. We are all be blessed to be alive in his glory. The scrape has changed you, Tefter. Changed me. Changed the dressings. Well, I found the bastard. I found out who I need to kill next. He's hot to the touch, and his mind fades in and out. But he lives. Perhaps a sickness of the blood. Shame, shame. He was captured by the men there? They claim to have been hired by Kunan. Kunan did this? I know not why. Only that he gave them coin to dispose of Tefter. You can see how well they saw to that. They were alike once, the boy and Kunan. God-fearing Christians arguing the nature of life with me. But he softened. Men do great evil to cling on to power and save their skin. Perhaps he means to put Tevda to flame in his place. Does not the right demand the leader? If he made the lad's body elderman, then it would still be right to sacrifice. Then he's not safe until I've dealt with Kunan. Can you tend to his wounds? I am a very good healer, but if the gods want him to join them, I cannot stop their will. Eivor, what will you do with Kunan? Uh, to be fair, 
Nah, screw that. I'm killing him. I'll gut him. Death and dishonor is the punishment he deserves. All legacy destroyed. Kunan may be ill and aged, but his sword arm is strong. He'll kill you first if you let him. Do not let him. My blade we is imbued do. with the blood of guards and armies. I fear not a single coward. You are resolute then. Then may you ride as Rhiannon. Thank you, Modern. And please, take care of Tefter. I must get to Kunan before the festival's end. Damn straight. This guy accused us of murder? We were so nice to him. We were honored guests. And you know what? He's gonna have to pay for that. There ain't no way he's getting away. That's for sure. But, I believe that's where we're going to end it for this episode here. It's a great place to pick off for next one. Whew, that was a good change of pace. It was a good first start where we had a good night. This guy was uh, definitely a party animal, that's for sure. I'm going to remember that. No worries. I got you. But, that was a, it was a quick change of pace. I knew something was, I knew something was brewing. I didn't know it was going to be this, but... It's definitely going to be a fun one, and we are going to take out Kunin, that's for sure. He is a douchebag. <laughs> All right, but I guess that's going to take care of it for this episode. And as always, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.